Hey everyone, welcome back to Rex TV. In today's video, we'll be discussing the recent developments in Zimbabwe's political landscape. The African Union O has been applying pressure on the Southern African Development Community, SADC, to organize fresh elections in Zimbabwe. The call for fresh elections comes amid growing concerns over the legitimacy of the current government led by President Emerson Manangwa and his party. ZANU PF. The O has raised alarm over reports of electoral irregularities and human rights abuses during the 2018 elections, which saw Manangwa come to power. Moreover, the Opposition Movement for Democratic Change Alliance, MDC Alliance, led by Nelson Chamisa, has been gaining momentum and support, further challenging the legitimacy of the current government, Chamisa who was the former president of the Citizen Coalition for Change CCC, has been vocal in his criticism of the ruling party and has been rallying for political reforms and accountability. Recent opinion polls and public sentiment indicate a surge in support for Chamisa and the CCC, with many Zimbabweans expressing disillusionment with the current government's handling of the economy and governance. There's a growing expectation that Chamisa and the CCC could emerge victorious in any future elections, posing a significant challenge to Manangwa and ZANU-PF's grip on power. The pressure from the 04 fresh elections reflects a broader international concern over the state of democracy and governance in Zimbabwe. The push for electoral reforms and transparency is seen as crucial in ensuring a free and fair electoral process that truly represents the will of the people. As the situation in Zimbabwe continues to unfold, it's clear that the political landscape is evolving, with the potential for significant change on the horizon. The AU's call for fresh elections and the growing support for the opposition signal a shifting dynamic in Zimbabwean politics, one that could have far-reaching implications for the country's future. What are your thoughts on the AU's pressure for fresh elections in Zimbabwe and the potential for a change in leadership. Let's continue the conversation in the comments below. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on this developing story.